snowed under James. It was winter time on the island of Sodor, and it was nearly Christmas. The engines were working cars, shunting trucks, and pulling coaches. One morning at Maypoint Station, Sir Tommy Hatt came to see his engines with exciting news. Since Christmas is nearly coming, we are going to have a party to celebrate. The engines were very excited. I have some special jobs for each of you. Nia, you and Percy will take the Christmas decorations for the station. Edward, you will collect the Christmas food and Mavis will be your back engine. Then Sir Tom Hatt turned to Thomas. He had a special surprise for Thomas. Thomas, Blossom, Bubbles, and Buttercup are coming to Sodor for the Christmas holidays. I want you to take them to the party. They will meet you at Vickerstown Station. Thomas was delighted. That's great. I haven't seen him for a very long time. As Thomas left, Sir Topham Hatt turned to James. James, you will take the presents. Okay, sir. At Vickerstown, Thomas was delighted to see the Powerpuff Girls again, and Bubbles was delighted to see Thomas. Hello, Thomas. Hi, girls. You and the professor made in time for the Christmas holidays. We sure did, Thomas. I haven't seen you in a long time. Yeah, I know. It's been a while. So, Thomas, are you ready to take us to Sir Topham Hatt's party? Yes, Professor, I am. So they climbed on board Annie, and Thomas set off. Meanwhile, James was taking the presents to Sir Tom Hatt's Christmas party. This is great! I'm on track and on time, too! But James didn't know that he was heading for trouble. The track was blocked by snow, and James was going too fast! His driver applied the brakes, but it was too late. I'm stuck! And he was. As Thomas arrived at the station, everything was starting to look like Christmas. Fizzling fireboxes! Everything looks great! It sure does, Thomas! Now all we need is James to deliver the presents! Then, Sir Tom Hatt came with some bad news. James is stuck in the snow! Thomas, I need to rescue him! or the party will be cancelled. Don't worry, sir. I'm on my way. Wait, Thomas! We're coming to help you, too! So we have no time to lose, girls. James needs our help! So Blossom, Bubbles, and Buttercup climbed on board Thomas's cab, and Thomas set off to find James. The wind was howling all over Thomas, but he kept on puffing. Keep going, Thomas! Blossom saw something in sight. I see something, Thomas. So do I. It looks like James. It was James, and he was glad to see Thomas. Thomas! I throttled your hair! James, what happened? I ran into trouble and got myself stuck. Don't worry, James. Thomas will get you there. As Thomas buffered right up to James, he tried to pull, but his wheels wouldn't grip on the icy tracks. It's no use. The tracks are too icy. My wheels won't grip. I can't get James out of the snow. Don't worry, Thomas. We'll help you. Bubbles, Buttercup, grab some chains and let's help Thomas. The chain was hooked on Thomas and James. Ready, Thomas? On three, pull as hard as you can. Okay, Blossom. 
One, two, three. Pull, Thomas! Thomas huffed and puffed as hard as he could. Pull, Thomas! You got it, Thomas! And with one big puff, Thomas pulled James out of the snow. Oh, thank you, Thomas. I thought I would be stuck here forever. Come on, James. Let's get you up to the party. I would love to, but my fire has gone out. Don't worry, James. I can tell you to Maceway Station. So Thomas buffered up to James and told him to make way station. They arrived just in time as the children cheered for Thomas and James. Good work, Thomas. And good work, James. Good work to all of you. Now you can enjoy the party. That night, the party was amazing. The tree looked wonderful in its decorations. Well, girls, what do you think of your first Christmas on Soldor? It's great, Thomas! It was great that you helped with your games! Thomas happily agreed.